Let's now take a look at the publish subscribe pattern. This is a, just a basic uh, broadcast pattern where a publisher just broadcasts uh, messages under different topics. And the subscribers um, can be subscribed to either uh, everything that's being published or they can subscribe to specific names that, that are being published. Another important thing to keep in mind is that the publisher doesn't care whether or not uh, any subscriber is online. It's almost like the radio. It, the radio station doesn't care if uh, any specific individual is out there listening or not listening. Uh, there's also something known as ZMQ Conflate. And if you have that um, uh, socket option set, the subscriber gets only the latest message and this is this is uh, useful in scenarios where you have a slow consumer or um, a consumer that is interested in only the latest information that's being published uh, by the publisher so we are going to take a look at PubSub Let's do the usual. Let's start off with two Visual Studio projects, both C++ 17. Let's get our imports, create a context, derive a socket, and generate some random numbers. What we'll do is, with equal probability, generate a price change for AMD, Intel, and Apple. And just to play along, assume that the norm dist is some you know, percentage price delta. So this is a multi-part message. The first part is the topic, and the second part is the payload. On the subscriber side, we subscribe to Intel and AMD only. We ignore Apple. And we print out both the topic and the payload. So as you can see on the left, three names are being published. On the right, two are uh, subscribed to. So that is plain old vanilla pub sub. 